Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Filter Diamond. The special edition of Filter Diamond. Today we're joined by challenger EU Nordic East. Player, AD carry player, multi master EUS, the real server. Oh, shouldn't say that. <laughs> Vapor Red Dark, who is here, one of my good friends, uh, here at Help Coaches today on um, on Phil Diamond. Uh, like, if you've watched previous episodes of Phil Diamond, you probably know that I've been on a bit of an AD carry hype, and with Vapor's help, we can help help elevate that to like the next level. This is not a channel that is known for its educational purposes, but the last ones that we did, which was like a three part mini series with Ben Nice was really um really well received and like a lot of people you know were commenting and sending lots of messages saying that they actually had a lot of value out of um out, out of watching them which is the the best possible thing that could have ever come from from that series so welcome danny plug plug what you want he makes lots of guides on mobile fire and stuff and he has a stream plug plug your stuff quickly oh, okay twitch at twitch.tv slash rapport dark twitter dot com slash rapport dark youtube dot com slash report dark instagram dot com slash report dark i think i got them all okay and also subscribe to the ross boom sucks channel so danny is um watching via discord screen share and um so i think like my first question like immediately off the bat is um i think like my summoner spells are like maybe where i'm immediately like a little bit of a question mark um so like on israel i think like more often than not i don't even end up running heal on them um and I don't know. You should be running just exhaust almost all the time on Ezreal. Yeah. You know? Um. So Quinn Heimerdinger, what do you think? Misfortune or Ezreal into this draft? I mean, Ezreal is always going to be the safest pick, especially in this meta. But comfort is more important than anything else. But if you're comfortable on if you're comfortable on both, I would definitely go Ezreal here. And it called Malulu. Meh. Oh God, that's actually awful. That's actually a really good duo into a lot of Ezreal lanes. Because you can't pressure the Kog'Maw hard enough until, like, like you can, you kind of beat him at the start, then eventually at, like, level 6 or even before, he just starts running you down and into that lane so hard a few days ago. So, like, with the, with the way that, like, I generally play lane is maybe, like, you could argue, like, too cautious a lot of the time, like, on AD. I, like, the reason I picked up AD carry initially when I, like, first started playing AD carry, like, seasons and seasons ago was because I was just sick of people, like, dying so much on bot lane that I was, like, well, I can't do any worse, right? So, like, I just went bot lane and then just farmed and just didn't die. Like, and that was it, right? So, like, sure. maybe I'm not winning lane necessarily, but, like, this was, I guess, when AD carries were, like, much stronger than they are now. And it was a case of, like, we just don't feed the enemy AD carry and then I try and outplay mechanically like, later on down the lane, but we're both just coming into the fights in the same thing. And, like, yeah, I've found, like, I have st I think I still got, like, kind of that play still in on bot lane where, like, maybe I play, like, a little bit safer than I should. But like, especially because I've been playing Ezreal a lot more, I am just like, I'm just, I just do not feel inclined to like take fights unless like, it's free real estate. <laughs> Unfortunately, that kind of, that playstyle kind of sucks against Lulu Kogma. But I mean, your support with your support is kind of like, there's nothing else you can do. You needed something like Nautilus or Leona in order to win the bot lane draft here. Yeah, I mean, something that can actually punish them early on. Rakan I'm just thinking sucks. like, Rakan wants to scale. The gank potential with these two to combine is pretty pog. Like, yeah, Nuna should be good at, and then a little at least. Hopefully, I'm I, in my head. I'm thinking Akali's a big roamer, right? So like, there's you know, and she can dive bot lane pretty easy. So like, I'm thinking mm -hmm. like, there's with these two, like on, on our bot lane, even though like I'm not necessarily the strongest AD carry, there's potential in the waters there. Yeah, if you, I play with Chad disabled usually just because I can't be bothered listening to what my teammates have to say. But since <laughs> you probably don't have Chad disabled, see if you can get Nuna to play around bot lane to say something like. You should play around bot in this game, in my opinion. You know, don't force it too hard, but just try and let them know that it's kind of important to play around bot in this game and make sure the Lulu Kog'Maw doesn't just run free and scale hard. Yeah, that's one way to say it. Hey, man, you gotta, you gotta say Pog, dude. You gotta be hit with the kids <laughs> at the lingo. They don't call me Pog Tony or Minor69 for, for nothing here. Like, oh, Nunu saying, yep, we love to see it. We absolutely adore to see it. Okay, there's still a 50-50 chance that he just will never gank bot lane, but it's, op it's you know, you should be optimistic. <laughs> I'll try my best, but I'm not the strongest early. I don't know, like, I'm maybe I'm, like, I'm, I'm a bit of, like, a suck-up a lot of the time when I play Rick ranks and stuff. Like, yep. I, 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 I can't count the amount of times that, like, I maybe feel like somebody is, like, a bit of a flight risk, and I've been like, no, it's fine, you're doing so good, like, don't worry, like, it's okay, just just play, uh, I love you, like, you're so strong, haha, <laughs> no, you're so sexy, haha, <laughs> like... <laughs> Like I don't, I don't know. I can, I can, I can imagine. I'm one of the very low people that actually ever bother to do that because I think there's a lot of them, um, a lot of ego in that lane. 
Are you at least enough? Go, 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 go. Oh, they're already pushing, so you're... I mean, I feel like this is a good sign for me, right? You've lost tempo. They're going to hit level 2, for sure. And they get to trade against you freely while you're trying to hit those. Oh, my goodness. Would have been nice to get shoving first, but if you're generally still leash, not much you can do about that. If you're going to be trying to match their push, just don't be afraid to use Kion minions. It's kind of hard to hit Qs on them when they've got a bigger wave, so just focus on clearing the wave. So if Rakan wants to make an engage here, you're good to do that. I think maybe, like, is this not bad? Because we're about... If, if Rakan engages, he's, he's engaging into a minion wave. Wait, no. Yeah, this is a decent time to fight. Don't be afraid to use your E, yeah? Uh, I would exhaust them. Should have ex. Mm. Okay. Uh, I wouldn't have flashed for it. Wait! No! Oh. Mm. Mm. <gasps> yeah, you want to use your exhaust a lot sooner in those. I, I was out of range, dude. I was. Uh, uh, I mean, yeah, I, I was. I, I, by the time I'd realized that it's exhaust time, it was, yeah. I was like out of range, and that was like such a peanut, yeah, yeah. that was a peanut play for That's me. That's fine. I was just saying, like, if you if you had exhausted, you probably could have easily forced to kill. But the flash is a bit over aggressive, I think, because you can just flash away as well. I, I think I would have actually maybe gotten them had I actually. I feel like I should stay on this. To be fair, wait. Mm, yeah, I would stay, and she might just greed here and. You want to wait for her to actually do something aggressive though there because if she took one tower shot she was dead there I know Like he's gonna have to back so I don't think I'm in too much danger here. This is yeah. this is like super stupid, but I'm mining for pog. You should be freezing this, but I don't know if Rakan is gonna I mean they're back and right like okay so should I yeah, Okay, you just go ahead and shove if they're that... actually gonna finish their back that was yeah. That, this uh, like so uh, yeah. I'm actually a peanut brain. The thing sure. is though, you're kind you're kind of running low on mana, so it's gonna be it's gonna take a while to finish shoving this. Also, work on this to help you if you can pick him to do that. He's fine. He's the fine. thing is when you when you're running running too low on mana to actually shove out a wave in a timely manner, the best thing to do is just leave it frozen and back. And because their wave is bigger than your wave, okay, they end up missing more minions. You you will miss some, but you will miss less than them. I have to see you know? like. I... Whereas you you sh you're shoving this so slowly that they, you're gonna crash this in time that they can still actually get most of those CS. I have to say I really need to get used to playing exhaust on um, Nidhi Carry. It's yeah. like a bit of a a change up in like how I would normally like. As you're so used to playing heal. Yeah, I was sometimes so resistant it's... to it at the start. So too. like, do we want to try and go for the Sheen early, or is it better to just try and go for that tier? Just go for the tier. Just sell your cookie for the tier. I see people saying like um, the sheen, like the import, the damage off of the sheen is like so important early on. That like it's yeah, she sheen uh, like before tier is viable if you can afford it. It's really good to play aggressive with that. But okay. if you can't afford it, don't don't bother like saving up for it. Just go for the tier. Okay, okay. This team, I'm like looking at it and I'm wondering like, is, is uh, what do you think, Trinity Force or because I'm, I mean that's a bit of hybrid damage, right? AP, but then it's mm -hmm. like I don't know actually. It's only Trundle and Quinn, so I don't think actually I think that the um. I mean, I pretty much always go Triforce, but uh, I I tell you what, man, like I I I, I would I would just say look at the state of the game. Like, is Kog'Maw fed? Is he not? Like, if he's getting a bit fed, you might want to use Iceborne just because of the slow to stay safe from him. But like, if you're doing okay, just go for the damage. So they're playing like super duper aggressive, but I honestly I'm like vibing with it because I just feel like it's like setting up. That's for... fine with Nunu being so close, you can just let him push and yeah, play the sure. gank soon. He's on his way. Kog'Maw's no flash too. You can let him. You can let Nunu know that. Oh, we're kind of engaging. Get exhausted. Yeah, that's really well played. I think I'm still losing this fight. <sighs> that's shielding. Hmm. Okay. Am I dead here? Oh, we're good. Yeah, no, you're good. Yeah, that... Yeah, you that real well. You held on to your E as long as you needed to. Yeah, I've... Yeah, that, that... I mean, barrier down as well, which is good. Yeah. Ooh. You know. Wow, you actually... You, I, well, you didn't quite dodge it. I just... <laughs> You could have just cuter, you didn't have to walk in the range, but that's fine. You are. Yeah, she missed greedy. the Q there. That's, yeah, I'm greedy. I'm 100% I'm <laughs> greedy. There is absolutely no doubt in my mind that I'm greedy. Uh, you can actually go pickaxe here. Just go pickaxe instead of. Uh... Okay. This is not to pie off, like, you know, what what's good on here, but, like, I I'm, I have to say, this is, first of all, first game of the day, and also, I am so mm -hmm. terrible under pressure. Like, when you put me under a microscope, <laughs> I crumble. Like, everything just begins to crumble. I, I, I know that, like, you you know, like, it doesn't matter. You don't care. Like, you're just trying to help. But, like, I'm just sitting here like, man, I was doing so much better at this game, like, not that long ago. Um, and also, that was quite a wild little, little run at me he just did there. Mm. Yeah, that's exactly why Ezreal kind of slicks into Lulu Kog'Maw. There's not much you can do <laughs> to stop him. Hmm. Just running you down like that if you can't one-shot him, which Rakan definitely can't. Um, 
the kind of thing that though. Okay, kind of big, kind of pog. Dare I say, pogtonium? Just was mine there. So like, as I say, like, you know, the performance isn't amazing, right? But that being said, the only death that I have was just, right, in my head, I'm like, okay, Lulu got the kill, so like, who cares? It's, but then again, and I think that's a, that's a, a toxic mindset to have, like, oh yeah, the support got the kill, so like, you know, it's, uh, it doesn't matter, right? Like, I got a kill. Mm -hmm. But like, I don't know if like, if that, if that logic even bears any war. Like, it does it, like, I'm sure it does. Like, support, support gold is probably, if anything, more efficient than ADC gold, so maybe I'm an idiot here. No, no, that's fine. The, the, the thing is, you always have to think about, like, minimizing deaths where you can. It doesn't matter, like, what the consequence was. Just, okay. if you think to yourself, I could have actually survived there. It doesn't matter, like, who uh, got the kill, but you just, you just think about what you need to do next time. Yeah, okay, cool, 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 cool. Um, I mean, realistically, given how aggressive they are, I'm super surprised to see that they are only, like, 15 CS up, and that's just because of fact, and then, like, you know, we're, we're similar kills. I'm, I'm thinking... In my head, I'm like, all right, this is not going amazingly, but it is a, a Lulu Cog lane, and that tends to go like up at 50 50 for me. Anyway. You're already doing way better than I did into Lulu Cog. <laughs> like, this uh, man th is. I doing... swear these guys are in thing, though. He's doing something wild right now, I will say. I think he like thinks that like just uh, Lulu is the miracle worker here. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, don't worry. Uh, Lulu will save me. Just try and go for this kid whenever he's leaving us up all from there. He's not standing behind minions for whatever reason. Got the uh, thing on him. Uh, Ian, Ian. Don't overcommit necessarily. But yeah, he's not even focusing you for most of that. Alright, you got the flash if you need it, but I don't think you should yet. Don't need it. Eat, eat Ooh. this, punk. Ooh. Oh, nice the double, one. baby. Yahoo. I even gave the, the 80s action hero one liner before I threw it, <laughs> and it hit, dude. Unbelievable. I, th I mean, I, I think, like, given how bot lane's going, I feel like maybe Nuna should have a little bit of a... Like, I'm 4-1. I'm actually doing okay now. Like, mm -hmm. it'd be cool if Nuna could come. But that being said, like, mid lane's in a bit of a shambles. Um, so I understand why it is not. Uh, you might... You just... You should just go mid now, I think. Yeah, this is a good example of my my macro coming out. Like, it just it kind of being non, non like... Non-existent, yeah, I, mean, I should say. Like, in my head, I'm like, oh, well, you know, they lost lane on their own. So, like, you know, I should, you know, go <laughs> get my own CS and let them deal with it. But maybe that's not the maneuver. I mean, this is a very unusual situation, I gotta say. It's not every day you have uh, Heimerdinger taking a tier 2 turret at 11 minutes. I'm kind of surprised that everybody has left and just thinks that this is okay. Like, yeah, ev everybody that's... is like, yeah, no, guys, Ezreal's got this one, lads. <laughs> Ez no, Ez can I get a hand here? Jesus. Uh, Lads. Yeah, just try and poke him, maybe, and then we'll gank him later. He's he's, com he's coming in the latest. It's like, uh, yeah. oh my lord. Oh, great. Oh. Mm, might have wanted to eat into your jungle. Yeah, I, I get a panic there. Uh, what is what is going on? Like, I, 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 this is one of these games that I'm just like, what the hell is happening? <laughs> Like, why? I don't know why Akali just was like, right, well, it's not my problem anymore. <laughs> but, like, also, yeah, I, was, like, I was only talking about holding mid lane for Akali until she got there. I, she just randomly went bot lane. And then Nunu was like, no, top lane, which is also in shambles <laughs> somehow. I don't understand what's happening. The game's falling apart, mate. What's going on? You know what? We still carry uh, it. We still carry this game. We still 100%. We win these. Oh, yeah, it's winnable for sure. So it starts with killing that trundle. I didn't. Wait, I pressed W and it didn't. Okay. I pressed W, but it didn't come out. Hold on. Watch this pick. Missed it. <laughs> Missed it, Paul. I, I don't think that would have called it anyway. Should have saved the ult yeah, for the yeah, way. Yeah. It, it's going to go down either way, though. It doesn't matter. Yep. Oh, my God. I'm oh, going to... I, I really don't want to do this. But I'm going to do it anyway. Skirt. No, that's fine. Uh, exhaust the Quinn, if you can, to save the Nunu. Mm, okay, I, I would... Maybe back off here? No? Okay, you got it. Yeah, no, depended if you could do your skill shots or not. After missing the first one, I I'm sorry to say I was not optimistic. Yeah, listen, there was a there was still a Heimer turret and stuff, and you know I was like a bit. Yeah. Cool, listen, cool. I, I'm somehow the glue that's holding this game together, right? <laughs> like I, it is what it is. <laughs> um, I could probably help Dragon here and then just go yeah, over the wall. you can drop your pink in the pit as well since nobody else is. All that, you probably won't need it, but better better safe than sorry. Yeah. Okay. Andrew's getting it. Now we're just back. Oh my god, my team are they're getting they're they're investing. Mm, okay. That might be good. 
It could be good, yeah. <laughs> They're just running past you. Not bad, not bad. Nice salt. Not bad, not bad. Get him, Akali. She just hex bladed her into oblivion. Wait, how did you, how how did did you wait. get that kill? Red buff? <laughs> Because yeah, right. I am skilled, Danny, is what that is. That's all skill, baby. Yeah, I, I honestly think that, like, we're not on the worst footing, considering we've been maybe, like, spread a little bit thin. Yeah, you're losing out hard on objectives, but in gold, I don't think you should be too behind. I mean, we, we've got two dragons somehow. I mean, we, I, mean I guess we got... The, the only thing that we're losing, you know, footing on is... Um, okay, you kind of need, you need to group with your team on mid lane right now. So just collapse, just to collapse on the hammer dinger if he overstays. Yeah, 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 for sure. Also, this is such a messy game, man. Like, yeah, top I, lane is top lane, mid lane is mid lane, bot lane is bot lane. It's 17 minutes into the game and... <laughs> yeah, man, this is, this, is a, this is how it goes, dude, for real. <laughs> this just kind of be how it is at that point, right? Uh, Just catch that bot wave. Or, unless you can get a kill here, but... No, I, I kind of thought maybe like, oh, if you were a mate, go for it. But, and 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 retrospect, why would she do that? Why would she even try? Like, that's just a terrible idea. Uh, I think Nuno is ganking you. So exhaust him, exhaust him. Yep. You didn't need to flash, not until after the exhaust, at least. Yeah, sorry, dude. I... When you, you see him gunning exhaust. towards you, man, you're yeah, yeah. just like, <laughs> let's. You know what, dude? We got three for zero on that. It's. Um, I mean, granted, they're taking top tower now, but you know. I don't know how are we how are we doing, dude? It's so hard for me to keep track of. Like this game is so messy. I don't know. <laughs> like you've lost so much gold to towers at this point, man. I don't know. Listen, as it, the thing is, right? Could I have done anything to avoid this happening? No, 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 no. This game was like... okay, right? So like on an individual level, I'm talking here. You could you could have gone more farm occasionally, but you know, the objectives are like not your fault. Okay, you know what? Careful not to get tower go there. You know what good. I'm saying? Didn't, you didn't actually need to use your either. Could just stay in range of Lulu and Kogma, like just to poke them with Q. I just like I, I absolutely. But yeah, no, did you just go? Absolutely point? hard panicking half the time here. I'm not gonna lie to you. Uh, just flank them. Like Fiora's gonna collapse them from the other side, so you can just. I don't think she is. Just poke, just poke them. Don't get in too close, but like try and hit them with. The, I mean, he's uh, he is okay, he, he is he's, he is winning that fight for sure. Uh. What's it? What, you've cleared almost all the turrets. You can probably jump in now. Or you can just walk up. That also works. Yep, that's cool. And now the pushing mid lane. It's so hard to like hit him. never ends. It's so hard to hit with skill shots because all the damn turrets. Like <laughs> yeah. it's. And also he is like absolutely trying to juke for Jesus here. He is like wailing out with the, with the moves. Right, I want you to be honest with me. Based on the way that the game is currently formatted, right? Is there any chance of us winning this? Yeah, I mean just by gold alone and like even the state of the map. Like, it should be okay. What I'm worried about is the fact that your teammates are not necessarily going to start playing better than they are. I think they've already shown their level, and uh, if, the, if that level stays the same, it's probably not winnable. <laughs> so the enemy are, like, better players as well. So. Yeah, pretty much. Like, okay. You're just getting ran down in macro. In my head, it doesn't. In my head, it doesn't even seem like macro. It just seems like mindlessly pushing. Yeah, I mean, that's the thing. Like, it's the most basic thing they could do, and your team is just not responding. Is counters Heimerding? Does he? Uh, no. Well, I mean, you can poke away the turrets, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Counter, it's dude. something. What do you mean, dude? That's a counter. <laughs> but there's a, there's a lot of champions that can do that. <laughs> yeah. Any champion with wave clear counters Heimerdinger, dude. Never lost a game. Champ Apparently. Champion has a 0% win rate overall. Um, see, like, they could be doing Baron right now. Your team does not give a f I would ult the Baron as soon as, as yeah, you can. Yeah, I'm trying to. You also need to be pinging it to your team. Yeah, I'm trying to, like. Where the heck? Where is the minion wave when you need it? Right, okay, hold up. Okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that burns down. I was not about to go face check. You see what I mean? Like, they just walk into the objective, they do it, your team just. They, they don't have a map at all. Callie, think. what are you doing? Oh my. Don't go in on that, dear. I, am I crazy in thinking that Baron isn't really a defining factor in games anymore? Like, in my head, I'm like. Okay, yeah, they got burned, uh, right? But... It, it depends on the game. Uh, the thing is, like, with how how hard they're pressuring your map right now, Baron is, like, absolutely everything they could have wanted. I read, like, given their team and, like, what they're doing, I honestly think that, like, as long as we're under terrors, I think we can, I, I feel like we can wave clear a lot of this. And, like, I'm just thinking, like, if they keep going under terrors and they keep making, like, stupid plays, like, it's 100%, like, you know, all to play for here. 
Yeah, maybe. Like, what did Hammerdinger expect? I have no idea. <laughs> but at the same time, he's done it a billion times. And not he has funny, done it. So. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. For sure. I mean, their, their team is basically running it down, but with, like, nobody to kill them, you know? That's what most of their play styles are. They're running it down, but nobody kills them. Oh, oh that... I was expecting, like... I, I, oh, see if Akali just went for the the Lulu there. I was expecting that. Like, I I, I eat in to exhaust to help the Akali, but I think she just mm -hmm. figured, like, all right, Lulu's easier target. Granted, we actually ended up trading better for that. We got four for two, but then, you know, this is happening right now, so... <laughs> Uh, that I think that 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 100 is my bad. I went to Team Nine there. I think went into that. Mm -hmm. Like I was. I mean, I, th I think you could have called Kogma, right? I think one of your cues came off cooldown, and you like were all, you were walking backwards, so there were minions blocking them. When you if you just like gone more ham there. I like the yeah. I I appreciate the Akali's like optimism. I mean, like, she's like down. She's got kills. She's down like half the CS, right? But like she's like, can I can I have this? I wonder. Yeah, just ping it. Hope for the best. Nice. Yeah, nice. Give me it. I think like I've definitely earned it, right? Like it's not like it's not gonna be a value, right? I I hate to. You're definitely doing way better than you should be with your team. Oh, that was a preemptive, preemptive volley there. Um, yeah. no, it's weird because like when I play AD carry, I always, like or like mid lane, I always feel like the buffs are something to be earned, and I I feel like that's not what it should be. But you, you kind of feel that in solo queue, right? Like mm -hmm. you say like, oh, I'm not gonna give it. I'm I'm never I'm not stupid enough to give this to a, you know a a, a zero three whatever what have you right like go on the hammer go on the hammer very quick jump on him yep okay oh damn probably could have flashed hopefully that. nuna should have him i'm not sure yeah, you, should, you could have jumped on him a bit sooner and i don't think he would have had his cooldowns in time yeah it was it was it was uh, i i was a coward because i saw trundle oh i really wish i could do more of this game i just feel like i'm not doing anything yeah Azure's wave player kind of sucks unfortunately so this is the kind of game i hate playing as in this game like is a bit of a weird one, so I'm trying to like gain, you know, learning points from this. But it's I'm not mm -hmm. gonna lie to you, man. It's a bit of a struggle. Like, you know what? We just gotta drop. If it. you're just trying to learn from it, honestly, you just play as aggressive as possible. Like, just try and get as much poke in as you can, even if it's like eing in. If you say you want to like go in for poke on the hammer dinger, but it involves using your E, so then you can use your E to like dodge his stun or his W or whatever. Just go for it anyway. Try and rely on dodging the stun or the poke through mechanics mm -hmm. and you'll just get practice that way this could be... you may as well take this game for limit testing if it's already gonna be a loss anyway this could be big this is big okay well i don't know about yeah. big but we're, we're, I, I'm, a, I'm waiting to see somebody appear here or here i'm telling you they're literally running it down yeah I, honestly Most like like is. listen i so like i think oh, they took baron again <laughs> yeah so like here's the thing right like uh, even in the filter diamonds i'm very much like i i try and take like the the the, the, the small victories is like Okay, well, at least I was X, right? So, like, in this in this case, I'm trying to think, right, was I more useful to my team than Kog'Maw was to his team? And I think, like, in the case of this, I think we might be in the clear. We might be blameless this game. 100%. But, like, it's hard because, you know, I could just... I, I, we'll look at the damage charts afterwards. For all I know, like, you know, Kog could be doing a lot of damage because he is just running in, right? But at the same it, time... It, yeah, I mean, th th it doesn't matter how much damage he did. Like, he's running it down half of his deaths so, and most of the time not even killing somebody. That's useless damage. <laughs> I mean, dude, he does... The damage charts only matter if he's not dying at the same time. If he's dying, it's worthless. By the way, you want to back very soon. You've already got your death stance. Yeah. Um, you know what? We're, we're going to do it now. I reckon. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I can catch that bot wave as well, hopefully. And stop. I was getting murdered. Let's go for the blue trinket as well, because you said so. What? Nice. Whoa. <laughs> dude, did you see that damage coming? I didn't. Yeah, I did not expect that. Uh, Hammerdinger's pushing bot. Okay, you gotta go bot. Go bot. Go bot. I mean, he's already taking that right? so that's like my main. Yeah, I think he was trying to go for Nexus Towers until your team stopped him. Uh, careful, you got Quinn, Exhauster. Now flash. Ooh, he, mm, I just. Wait, was that, lucky. Where was his turrets? Oh, there's the, the minions, dude. Ah, oh, I'm so stupid. Uh, so, like, definitely a thing that I'm, I 100% find as well when I play AD carry is like overcompensation, right? I think maybe that's like a, just a thing that I have, like, in general, like across all champions and all, and all things like that. Like, if my team are doing badly, I will 100% make dumb plays trying to like, <laughs> the, I'll, I'll do like the, the do or die mode play where I'm like, all right, yeah. either I, I mean, get, normal, either I get a triple kill or I int it, right? 
the more of a loss that the, that a game seems, the more risks you may as well take. Like a risk is not a, not always bad, right? Like almost every good play in League of Legends has some risk. It can always backfire, but there's like an acceptable level of risk. And if you're gonna lose anyway, then that acceptable, like what makes a play acceptable, like is goes there, up, you know? Is there any game changing last night, like last cu couple of items here? Should I just go blade or? Yeah, I would just probably go blade either that or ga most of the time you're not struggling with staying alive though so i'd probably just go for bork yeah i mean i've only died well actually five times it's actually quite a lot i know that i think about it but yeah never mind i tell a lie take back what i was about to say there yeah see if i were Sivir or if you were Sivir, you could clear this wave super easily but you're ezreal so yep here we are i think like if you have like frozen gauntlet on him it's like a little bit easier just because like the aoe no it you get a small bit of AoE with Gauntlet, but like the single target damage you get with Triforce is way bigger. Fair. Your your wave player just sucks either way as Ezreal. There's no saving it, honestly. I see. Like I don't want to go in on that stuff because I'm I'm 100% aware of like. Yeah, you. The minions are about to blast the hell out of our base. Yep. So if I if I back off, like we are just gonna like lose everything. Yeah, you you just follow up like slightly, but you can't go too hand. Yeah, you I always can't. Have to, like, yeah, I'm trying to be looking at the base as well. Here comes Cog with double buff. Amazon Prime delivery straight to my door with the double buff. Here he is. Exhaust, did you have it? You don't. Da uh, okay, uh. never mind. It's Cog mode. Three, four aims. <laughs> <laughs> never mind. I thought he was on his own, and then all of a sudden they come out the fog of war, and I'm like, ah, I'm an idiot. No, this is. I think this game's on, my, on me, to be honest. Like, I, I, I reacted poorly throughout the course of the game to like what they were doing, and I just couldn't help enough. No, I, th I think you did fine in that regard it's just, you never had like enough teammates around you to properly react like it, for example with the hammer dinger when he was like trying to push the tier two i i told you to like go mid and you listened and that was you know you did what you should could what you could but then rakan didn't come nuna didn't come akali didn't come you just ended up like uh. trying to defend the midway the mid lane but eventually obviously still went down because you weren't really able to do anything on your own Throughout the game, like it was literally their team just taking objectives uncontested every single time. And if you're the only one contesting them, well, I mean, man, I really did no damage. That only game. so many things you can do. Hammer Dinger did so much damage that game. Yeah, I mean, people were running it down into him, so they either ignored him or they ran into him and died. Whew. There was very little in between. Oh, uh, that guy seems a bit angry. Fiora, I wish for your whole family <laughs> suffer and die, you moron, reporting me. I don't think anybody in your team did well. Actually, I'm surprised the Kali even had such a good score. I mean, well, okay, there were some good. Yeah, there were definitely some fights where she did a lot of work. Just never seems like she was actually around to. Like she was. Every single person on your team was complicit to just giving up every objective. Really, like when that that time when I pointed out they could be on Baron, you couldn't can check the Baron on your own. You're Ezreal. Of course, you can't do anything there. You need your team to come. Nobody came. <laughs> Pretty much your entire team was a fault there. Well, we didn't do amazingly, but nevertheless. I actually think I may have learned something during that. I think I'm going to play a game of Misfortune in another episode mm -hmm. of this. If people want to see it, then by all means, like, let us know. Um, but regardless, thanks for watching. Have a fantastic day. Anything you want to plug? Uh, Twitch.tv slash dark, Twitter.com slash dark, Instagram.com slash dark. I feel like I'm forgetting something. YouTube.com slash dark. There Onlyfans. we go. Onlyfans.com slash dark. Yep, Onlyfans.com slash dark. <laughs>